five key areas to a great property strategy. Sourcing and acquisitions, funding, delivery, financial management, and number five, team. Really important. Uh, if you don't have some kind of team behind you, you're going to be doing everything um, and it's going to be really hard for you to scale the business up and also to focus in on the areas that you love and that you're great at. Uh, I'm really grateful we've had Lucinda, who many of you will know, has been supporting us for a number of years now across Tomes Homes and Property Strategy. Uh, she's juggled multiple roles <laughs> across both companies uh, with ease, without getting stressed, and I really count her as the glue that holds us uh, together. Together. So make sure you've got your own version of Lucinda who can help you and support you in going out there and being more strategic. Uh, this year has seen the team really expand though, uh, which we're really excited about. And you know, my mentor, uh, our mentor always spoke not just about team, but about talent. Uh, and we're really starting to see what that truly means. Um, kind of from last year through to this year uh, as we start to develop that team so we're really excited we have got our, our financial controller in the business used to uh, work for a property company turning over about 50 million dollars a year so massive compared to us we're around half a million so we've got a long way to go to that get to that point but we've got someone bringing that level of expertise who's run that accounting uh, side of the business for someone else and is now with us helping us to really take our um, our financial processes our risk management to the next level we've also got my wonderful dad who's been with us for a while now um, he uh, deals with a lot of the more sales side the negotiation side of everything that we do and it's amazing he used to do it for Barclays doing deals worth hundreds of millions of pounds with different banks and he's he's with us helping us to negotiate um, and do great deals and great business uh, we've also got um, a new team member who uh, are supporting us on the letting side um, and the delivery side of the uh, the business more, who used to be an area manager for a large estate agency and uh, now bringing uh, those those skills in-house to Tomes Homes to make sure that what we're doing is as, yeah, as professional um, uh, and taking our, that area of what we do uh, to the next stage. Uh, and our most recent uh, new hire, we've got uh, uh, someone who has been spearheading uh, marketing campaigns for uh, the UK government, uh, marketing events for like 250,000 uh, attendees uh, and Leanna's on board now uh, working with us to support us with our marketing so it's it's pretty humbling actually to be at the point that we've got such wonderful people with such great expertise in their field coming in uh, to support the overall vision for Times Homes for property strategy um, and it's it's not just team it, it's a talented team too and you start to realize that you really are not the best person to be doing things anymore so make sure you are First of all, building that vision that you're going to have a uh, that talented people are going to want to buy into and to come and work for you and to, to make uh, uh, to make it an appealing place to work to. Uh, you know, we we're very flexible with how we uh, work with uh, those uh, our team members, and I think it's really helped to bring on amazing people. Um, and now having that great vision that we're striving more and more towards uh, is is really really exciting. So focus on that. Build that great team. Build, uh, bring in people who are great at what they do, who are better at what they do than what you do, uh, and then just learn to step back and not be such a control freak. That's a note to self, by the way.